Hello my beautiful ninjas, it's Nani and in today's video I am going to be doing a review on this Power by 50 Cent Cologne. So in honor of Power coming on this weekend, definitely let me know down below if you guys will be watching Power, let me know. But in honor of it coming back this weekend, I wanted to go ahead and do a review on the fragrance called Power. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Alrighty, so again, you guys know that I like to talk about packaging, but I'm not going to take a long time with this one. This is basically what the package looks like. It's a pretty standard bottle. It's a black bottle, but it has like little grooves in the middle. Like every so often it has like little grooves or indentations in the middle of the package itself. So, I mean, it's nothing special. It's not, nothing extravagant. It's nothing different or anything like that but obviously the fragrance is what we purchased this for this actual size itself you can get them direct get this directly from fragrance net for 15 yeah so it was anywhere from like 10 to 15 dollars is the pricing that kept coming up so i am going to go ahead and give you guys a description of it i'm not going to spray it just because um i damaged the thing so i had to spray it on my arm if not it's just going to basically get all over the place but just to give you guys kind of like a description of what this actually smells like the first thing that i can tell you is that this is definitely a very green fragrance especially when you first spray it out you definitely smell just kind of like an overpowering like green citrusy type of scent it smells kind of like herbally if that makes sense i feel like the scent itself is can be a little bit offensive to some people just depending on what they like um, but what I do like about it is that it's di it's different. So it's a little bit more sexy, a little bit more intriguing. Once it dries down into the skin, it smells just sexy. I don't even know how else to describe it, but it's like a very different, unique, exotic, sexy. It's kind of like um, mysterious. I think that's the right word that I was looking for. It's a little bit more of like a mysterious type of scent where it's like, tell me about yourself I want to know a little bit more like it's one of those type of fragrances if I had to give this a rating I feel like I would give this a three stars and the only reason I give it a three stars honestly is just because of the fact that it is such a different distinct scent that like I mentioned it can be a little bit more offensive to a lot of people so I feel like a lot of people may not necessarily like it but all of it definitely depends on your body chemistry so of course even though these are the fragrance notes and this is my description of what it actually smells like your body chemistry may project it a little bit different but it's still very sexy it is something that will still get you compliments if it is something you know if you are around a woman that kind of likes these fragrances but I just feel like if you wear it right with the right thing and you you wear it to like a right um event because i feel like it's one of those fragrances and i think that's what it is it's one of those fragrances that if you are in closed quarters like if you're in the club i don't think that you should wear this just because i feel like it's already hot you're in closed quarters like you're dancing you're moving around it may come off a little bit too strong a little bit too overpowering and too offensive to some people but if you are like i mentioned date night with like your woman i think this would be one of those kind of like sexy animalistic mysterious type of fragrances so i think that you'll like it for that for sure so definitely let me know if you guys have this fragrance how you like it and how it projects on your body i would definitely love to hear exactly how it works for you guys of course like i mentioned i wanted to do the review on this fragrance just in honor of power coming on this weekend I am a little bit just kind of like on defense. I don't know what to expect just because I feel like last season or the past two seasons kind of like disappointed me a little bit with, um, especially with uh, Tariq Malik, child, the boy that watched his sister get shot, him. So I feel like because of that, I'm a little kind of like on defense since then, but I'm still definitely going to watch it. So definitely let me know down below if you guys are going to be cuddling up with your boo thing to watch Power this weekend. But again, thank you guys so much for tuning in to another video. If you enjoyed it, definitely give it a thumbs up and of course, subscribe to my channel for more. Till next time, peace.